here welcome to waste some time with Maggie I've come on to do a mixed media Wednesday a pick 10 it's late but it is still Wednesday so we'll just pick out I've given them a, a twirl around but, so we'll just pick our sticks and then go from there all right add glitter or glitter paint Use stencils, add metallic paints, add flowers, use bubble wrap, use happy mail, was it two, four, six, collage newspaper or magazine text. Add hearts, two, four, six, eight, two more. Add stars and use stamps. Right, okay, I shall get my stuff together and be back. Right, I'm back. And first of all, I think we're going to start with some stamping and I'm just going to do a little bit of just a little bit of text on the page just put it any which way just to give us something on the background I think to start off Right, we've done that. We've got that one done. Right, now I think we'll have... What will we use? We need a little block. I didn't get a block. I've got a block here. Right. Just going to build up a background. Right, that right, stem. Hmm. Come back, and then we'll have another little ring, I think. Yep, right, I think that's enough stamping. My all in shot there, oh yes. Right. Right, so that's our stamping. And now, I'm going to stencil some stars. What are we going to have? Little gold stars, maybe? Right, now, where are my dobbers? I forgot my dobbers, I'll be back. Right, I'm back. I don't know how this is going to go. Some little gold stars around. Oh, showing up quite nicely actually. Yes. Right. Maybe some down there. Right, we have put star stars down. Oh, stars right now now so we've done we have done stars and we have done 
stamps. And we're going to now do some hearts. Now what color am I going to do my hearts? And we're using metallic paints. And this one here is festive red. Why not be bright? I don't know how good this one is. I haven't. Oh, yeah. Red hearts around. I think this is going to be quite a hot mess by the time I've finished. Yep, that's enough of that, I think. Right, just clean that off. Right, so we have used hearts. Get that out of the road. Next, we're going to use bubble wrap. We've used stencils. We use stencils, so we'll take that away. I will be using more stencils, but we'll just move those out of the road. Now, metallic paints we're using, so I'll move that out of the road, and we've got some bubble. Bubble. Bubble, bubble, bubble wrap here. What colour am I going to do with my bubble wrap? We might have some moss pearl. This one is. I haven't used these for a while. Give it a shake, I think. Oh, that's a pretty colour. That is a pretty, pretty colour. Oh, no, that's not what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm supposed to be using bubble wrap, aren't I? Um, I'll just turn it onto the bub bubble wrap. You can actually see that, but they're definitely there. There, 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 there. <laughs> there, there. Right. Get all that out of the road. Get rid of the bubble wrap, or shall we do another colour of bubble wrap? Maybe we will. Maybe we'll go a little darker green. Look at the darker green. I've got a very bright green. What's this one? Dark patina. Pat, yeah, patina. Dark patina. Okay, we'll have a look at this one. It's a green as well. Mm. I think that one's a bit gummed up. Just keep my hold. Give it a poke. Whoops. Oh, it's a bit, a little bit thick. Take the lid off and have a look at it. Oh, it's got a, it's got a skin on the top. We'll just get rid of that. And then see if we can squirt out any paint. We should be able to because it's sloshing around in there. Yeah. Don't know if this is any darker. Um, oh, yes, it is, right. Okay. Put it on there. It's a little bit darker. Yeah. And it's definitely a little bit darker. Right, that's enough of that. Right, 
get rid of that, clean that off. Right, I'm knocking the sticks down now. Oh dear. Right, that's looking like a hot mess. Right, we've used bubble wrap. Put that out of the road. Got glitter, oh, flowers, and happy mail. Right, I'm going to bring a stencil back. But I think I might just dry it off first. Right, I'm back again. And I've got another stencil here. And I'm going to be doing a little bit of everything on this one. Hopefully this will show up. A little bit more paint here. This is a black metallic. I don't think I've used it very much. So, oh yes, it's coming out quite nicely. Alright. A little bit more. More down here. And some more in this corner. Right, we're done with the black, getting mucky hands here. Right, now we're going to use a metallic blue for, this, for these butterflies. And this one down here. Right. Now, let's have a little peep under there. Oh, yes. It's all right. Now, I've got a, what have I got? I have got amethyst and berry. To do these flowers here. Right. Oh, yeah. We've really sort of lost using the um, the other colour over the top of it, didn't I? That was a bit stupid. Never mind. They're very old, these paints. I think they're just losing their, um, I might do that again because it just added to it, didn't it? Yeah, they're very, um, gone funny. Right, we've got another one up here. I'll do that one. Right, I think we are done there. Let's see what a mess it made. Mm, butterflies didn't come out very good, but the black marks came out quite nice. So I'll get that out of the road so I don't get it everywhere, and I'll dry that off, and then I will be back. Right, I'm not very happy with my butterfly, so I'm just going to go over them a bit with black and see if I can just outline them a little bit better. We'll see. You most probably completely stuff it up, but hey, can't be any worse. Just see if that made it any better. Oh, it gave a bit of a black outline. Not really, but never mind. Okay, right. Now, what are we going to do now? Add glitter or glitter paint. Oh, I forgot about that. Right. Flowers and Happy Mail and newsprint. I've got some 
I don't have any newsprint, but I do have some book, uh, telephone book. So I'm going to use the telephone book in place of newsprint. And I'm going to do a shorter one. And we're going to have another one over this way. I'll just take that off there. Thin. Somehow like this. And our happy mail and flowers. I've had these an awful long time too. And I got them from Betsy Doodle. Right, that's the littlest one, I think. Is that the littlest one? I think so. I think we have that one there. This little one down here. And this one. They can go like that. That can go like that. And this one here, I think what I am going to do so right just find my glue stick and some paper right let's get all that out of the road so I can have some space to glue I've been very busy the last few days and very, very tired. My um, sciatica has been playing up something terrible from sleeping on the couch. Had my first night in my bed last night and I had a terrible sleep. The bed was comfortable enough, but I think my back has just um, flared up from sleeping on the couch and it's going to take a little while before it settles back down so I'm hoping it'll I'll get a bit of sleep tonight right let's just take that one up off there like that so it can go a bit higher and this one here This way here, hopefully, can get those flowers so they fit on. Let's have a look, and they move about because they're just tied together with string. I want that one to go there, like that. Which one? So this one is going to go down here. And that one's going to go up there. No, I'm going to move that over to here, straight down. So I can do there. Like that. Now, put that there. Yeah. This one here. It moves those out of the road. See if I can pull that up. And I'll just move it straight up that way. And it can come down a little bit. I've got to get it so we don't have it. And then this one here, we'll just have down like that, I think. Ooh, like that. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to glue the one on the back so they can still move right get you there like that I think and that'll just go down like that I've had these in my stash since since 2020 from Betsy Doodle I've got a magnet one on my fridge Right, that one's going to go there. So they can just twirl around still. And this one. 
is going to go down here like this. Oh, I like that. I do like that. Right, so we have used Happy Mail and Flowers. And we have used our newsprint or our faux newsprint. Now we've got to add glitter. So what I think I'm going to do is get a little bit of clear. Mm, if I can open it. Mm. Sometimes, you know, having to open things for a while, they take a bit of... Right, move all that out of the road. I'm going to put some glue. Just some clear glue down. And get myself a little paint paintbrush. And I'm just going to put glue on the top petals. Of these flowers, and then I'm going to sprinkle some glue on um, some gold on them, and then um, hopefully dust the rest away. Right, this one. Right, and this green one. Oops. Right, and let's sprinkle some more on. Right, now, let's hope I can get it off and have it not stick everywhere. Right. We'll just get a, a dry brush. I think it's going to stick around, but that's okay. I don't mind if we have a little bit of glue, uh, glitter sticking around. And it actually stayed on me. I don't know if you oh, yes, uh, can see the glitter. Right, so I have used all my prompts. So now I am just going to put a black border around it. I'm just going to use whoops my what is it? It is a um permanent mark just a permanent marker and no name. I am not the greatest at doing straight borders, so I don't really try. This way. I like to have a border on my pages. Right. I'm not exactly unhappy with it. <laughs> Can't say it's my best, but the prompts weren't all that great. And the date today is the 17th. 17th of the 4th, 24, 24. Oh, I'm quite happy with it. Just 
Okay, oops, the road. And give you a little look at our messy layered background. It's not too bad. So thank you for being with me. Kia kaha, stay strong, and I'll catch you again soon.